Motion Introduction We often perceive an object to be in motion when its position changes with time. However, there are situations where the motion is inferred through indirect evidences. An object may appear to be moving for one person and stationary for some others. Most motions are complex. Some objects may move in a straight line, others may take a circular path. Some may rotate and a few others may vibrate. There may be situations involving a combination of these. Uniform motion Consider an object moving along a straight line. Let it travel 5 meters in the first second, 5 meters more in the second second, 5 meters in the third second and 5 meters in the fourth second. In this case, the object covers 5 meters in each second. As the object covers equal distances in equal intervals of time, it is said to be in uniform motion. The time interval in this motion should be small. Non-uniform motion In our day-to-day -day life, we come across motions where they cover unequal distances in equal intervals of time. For example, when a car is moving on a crowded street or a person is jogging in a park. These are some instances of non-uniform motion.